This is the style I'm wearing and as you can see what I was trying to do here is give myself a break from manipulating my hair so I wanted a protective style which I haven't done in about well about <laughs> over a year now because I BC'd I big chopped on about eight months ago and now it will be a year since we big chopped but remember we big chopped after one year a long-term transition so this is one of the styles that you can wear uh, as a protective style I crochet braided um, the hair the hair comes looking like this and each time I separate this in about five or six pieces of which I then crocheted on a conroe protective styles are interesting for several reasons um, they're interesting because they give yourself a vacation from hair maintenance in terms of styling however it doesn't mean that you're not to wash your hair I am very attached to the you know to H2O being used on this hair so it means that while I'm rocking this we're still gonna have to wash the hair it certainly does not mean that you're gonna have an unclean scalp you know that our thing is always for your scalp to be properly cleansed so this is an idea that you can use to your advantage if it gives you satisfaction um, in this video you are able to see how it's done my case I only took out my edges all around my head and I'm actually not finished that's why the style is this way <laughs> I did it alone so it was not possible for me to do it rapidly then you have the challenge of having to do it behind your head which is also possible without help but you have to be organized in my case I just didn't have time so I will get to it when I get to it this hair that I just showed you is great because when you separate it as you can see with the front there is a blend going on so I just flat twisted using my a gel as a styler I did all the hair and when it was dry I just took it out and you can actually see from this side how it blends in with the rest of the hair which I like so we really want to encourage you to use protective styles as an option and if you're not going to use protective style you want to use a style that requires the least manipulation possible so you can continue on with you being natural or you being textured I rather the word textured than natural because when people use natural I get the feeling that I mean people know what you're referring to but at the same time saying I'm natural is kind of like okay no to this and no to that and pro to this and pro to that and you know us at HMS we are into you using wisely whatever you have at your disposal and filtering all the junk so you want to filter the junk or you want to filter everything that is stripping but at the same time you can't exactly just get rid of them because you kind of need them at one point so it's just about being strategic and that we we show you how to do that and we're happy to be able to help you know help you in your endeavor so anyway that being said I was told today by my family oh honey you're so cute <laughs> every woman loves a compliment don't you see you next time